you know what it is. The Emoji movie was called, the worst animated movie in 2017. Yeah, everyone called it that, and there is a reason for it. The movie is cringe, embarrassing, and they have old memes from 2016 that were outdated quickly, like the pineapple apple pen meme. What the hell? That meme lasted from October 2016 to November 2016, so I guess you are a bit late for it. The movie is a rip of two inside out, the Lego movie, and wreck it Ralph. You might be saying, but Joker, being different is a good message. Yes, you are right, but this movie almost took the same route from the Lego movie, and it's ridiculous. They could have taken a different route, but no, they bitched out. This movie is full of advertisements, like Spotify, Candy Crush, or Just Dance. Why is Candy Crush in this movie? That's a game that only Facebook boomers would enjoy. No offense, Facebook users. This game is old and no one seems to play this anymore. As for Spotify, I hate it. They have too many ads playing every after 3 songs. It makes me want to download songs and use iTunes more than Spotify. Screw Spotify. As for Just Dance, don't you think the Just Dance series would be on a game console instead of on any app stores? Just saying. Let's talk about the characters. Jean is a cliche outcast protagonist. He is a meh emoji which has different personalities coming from his father, which he had to hide them so long, which I'm surprised that he did. How come Jean's dad did it so well and better than Jean? Jailbreak is a wild style ripoff. Except as if Wild Style was a hacker or something. Jailbreak also turned out to be a princess, which is a weird twist. What the hell was that? As for High Five, you'll never guess who voiced him. Yeah, of course, it had to be him. Why was he always in shit movies? Can anyone explain that for me, please? Anyways, High Five is a stupid character. I don't care about him anyway. Smiler is a creepy villain and incredibly bland. I never wanna see her ever again. And Alex is just Riley from inside out, but without anything interesting about what the character is. That was literally it. How boring. Screw this movie. 0 out of 10. This is Joker Critic. Signing out. Bye.